Hi everyone, it's Tanya from Cup of Cha Tea Channel, the place for all you tea lovers and tea addicts to build your tea knowledge. Today is the second episode of my tea chat with Sir Jay from Moi Chai. In the last episode, we talked about Russia's tea culture and how a large majority of people, especially in the bigger cities, embrace the Chinese Gong Fu Cha. But how did it get there? And in today's episode, Sergei is going to take us down the track of discussing who the pioneers were of today's Russian tea. Russia has a long history with their neighbor, China, from the 16th century, from the ancient tea uh, Silk Road, I should say. As Russia opened up in the 90s, there were two pioneers that led the way for the Chinese loose leaf tea to be once again explored within the Russian culture. So let's dive in and explore how Russia developed a thriving loose leaf Chinese tea market. And you have a, a number of neat uh, tea clubs, don't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have a 17 for now, 70. Uh, 17 and still still I'm working on opening um, of other clubs yeah. and we have uh, six in Moscow two in St. Petersburg and also rest in mm. other cities mm. and uh, our, our method is uh, also like uh, we studied from the beginners uh, there's a beginner who opened uh, first tea club in Russia it's uh, Branislav Vinogrodsky and Mikhail Baev uh, Branislav is uh, uh, our Russian pretty famous uh, he's a uh, uh, sy sy uh, sinologist, okay. and uh, she is also translator of all traditional Chinese books. Yeah. And Mikhail, she is uh, uh, she like uh, traditional uh, Eastern martial arts, and she we just uh, opened the first club in the 90s. And after that, they just bring this culture of a very high level, because Bronislav translate very old Rui uh, book. Mm. And also studied all the masters in the club, the f on the first club, very on very high level, very ceremony, the the impact of any point of any point of any uh, type of tea, the only type of tea where anything was very really described on very high level, mm. and and uh, a lot of people think, oh, this is this is a sect, this is like they're just sitting on the ground yeah. <laughs> and, and they're just talking very silently and then drinking four small cups it's like a sect especially in the 90s it was like a, yeah everyone's scared but uh, a lot of rich people come in too because uh, maybe because of charisma or Branislav and also because they mm. promote it like uh, you just drink a cup and you understand yeah. that is it and uh, it became more and more popular. Mm. After that, uh, there's also other people who make it from other way. Maybe they use some Western style, but they also use a nice material, or they use okay. uh, some Japanese tradition, yes. or they use a uh, Taiwanese tradition. There's yeah. a lot of different communities of tea yeah. in Russia. But uh, what we do, we just uh, complete all of that uh, together, uh, just uh, compilate uh, more useful tips what we think we can yeah. use uh, so we have a we have a European style uh, tables in our tea club so yeah. also we have an Eastern style like okay. uh, like old opium smokers yeah. <laughs> rooms yeah <laughs> someone fingered that but uh, it's it's of course it's for tea but yeah. uh, for now in China you can't find it like that yeah. it's, it was a discovery of uh, Borislav and he was first who made it in Russia and after that a lot of people copy as we okay. too but we change a bit, we make yeah. our own uh, mind in that and also we have uh, only f the most freshest thing we have it's just a coffee machine uh, which can brew not coffee but tea, tea we yeah. just uh, make it a powder from the tea and mm. uh, brew, uh, brew it through coffee machine mm -hmm. and it's pretty nice also yeah. but it's just a new a new yeah. discovery <laughs> we just yeah, uh, yeah. Only, only have it in two clubs but, okay. but yeah. uh, for now we're just yeah. looking for the how it is, uh, how to place it together, because yeah. it's also a club for from opening uh, some lectures for uh, musicians. Oh, uh, okay. And also just like a, like a club for 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 gathering different people. Yep. Who who open-minded okay. people and just call it that like yeah like that and uh, uh, those um coffee machine um yeah. 
I've heard they're in Hong Kong. Yeah. And I know they're in Taiwan yeah. as yeah. well. Yeah. Like except it's for tea. Yeah, yeah. You just need mm. to and it need to study how to use how, yeah. how much to take, which type yeah. and how to mix it with uh, yeah. juices or not mix or just make it clear. Yeah. Or how to mix it with some additional flowers or so mm. it's just need to study. It's like a, also like gunfu. Because yeah. for now we have one guy who just uh, very, very excited about that he has yeah. he a lot of experiments how to do how to mix mm. and we have our own view how to promote it and maybe it will be like a door to europe for us yeah because we're just working for exploring from russia for yeah because you've got to keep moving forward it's yeah. it's good to appreciate the history yeah yeah but yeah. moving forward yeah 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 also, and, also, and within within the modern lifestyle yeah yeah, yeah. I, mm. I what i what i think about we just don't uh destroy older we just no. add something exactly it, it's like, like with the or nearest club it will be like that in the entrance maybe like a coffee machine or some tea to go mm. and after that a shop uh, all these some uh, yep. hundreds yeah. of keys teaware anything yep. after that a uh, western um, place for sitting on the tables and yes. drinking tea you yes. can drink herbal or you can drink yes. gufu cha or you can drink mate mm. uh, mm. and mate anything and any in any point any kind we just m try to do it uh, as nice as we can yes. not like like by as chinese or Serbian, <laughs> like mm. uh, like something uh, mate what you can't drink by yourself yeah uh, we buy nice mate i go to okay. argentina i find nice the same with China, with the same with Russian herbal tea, anything. Okay. Try to do directly to the producer and more work like that. And uh, in the tea club inside, there is a, a little western in the home, yeah, how to, backyard. Backyard, <laughs> tea club, yeah. backyard yeah, is a, is a eastern, like uh, on, the, on the floor, like uh, eastern style. Yeah. Uh, and, yeah. And each one who come to our club, he just feel, oh, if I want to just tea to go okay if i want to buy tea okay if i want to participate some uh, concert okay mm. if mm. i want to drink uh, tea western style okay any mm. anyone welcome we don't uh, do it like but the main thing well, the main thing which uh, uh collect all these things together is a product we don't have a tea bags we don't have any mm. uh mm. tea that that i can drink by myself yeah. which is the main thing if you have a nice product, we can prepare it any any kind of uh, we can use it with any any type of preparation. Okay. So it's yeah. most important. 